door, they're very anxious too. A million thoughts were going through my head, but as soon as they opened the door, she like instantly looked at me like, I don't know, as if she knew. Hi, I'm Courtney. <laughs> this is my husband, Chris. Hello. I'm sorry. Come on in. Hi, my this is here. I couldn't help but feel her compassion. Come in, sit down. Can we get you guys a cookie or a drink or anything? <laughs> no, thank you. Okay. It's so nice to meet you. <laughs> it's okay. Her feelings were my feelings, and I could see it because we were both doing the same weird little kitty, like, you know, laugh and stuff. So I was nervous. We're a bit overwhelmed ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> the moment she hugged you guys, she <laughs> breathed. <laughs> it was like instantly, I felt like I knew them. It was really weird um, how great they were. Great they are. I know nothing <laughs> is written in stone. This is just a meeting. We want this to be a fit all the way around. We don't want just the baby. We want to make sure it's right for you, that we're who you want, and you know. I knew we were going to see them, but sitting there with them, it was kind of perfect. <laughs> is there anything that you hope for, for for the baby, or? A newborn is a lot, you know, and she was worried about, you know, daycare and whether you would be home. No daycare. <laughs> he runs his own business from home, so he's home all day. Um, I work from home just as needed, so I just know I want to either be working from home or be able to be home with my kids. And it's the best thing in the yeah, world. That's, that's yeah, that's always been my big thing. <laughs> yeah. And you have no kids, right? No kids, You've no. you trying for six years? Five. Five years? Yeah, five. We'll have our ninth wedding anniversary in December, and we've had seven miscarriages. I've had five. Knowing what they've been through, because I've been there, is really hard on me. And every time it was, well, we're going to try this, and this is going to work this yeah. time, and it yeah. didn't. Yep. Yeah, we've done blood thinners and hormones, and we just prayed about it, and we feel like we're supposed to adopt whether or not we have our own kids biologically. And we've just been waiting and praying and going through the state classes that they make you do and the home studies and stuff. They seriously wanted a child. It made things a little bit easier for me.